We got Oswaldo Cabrera, fan favorite here with us. Dude, thank you so much for hopping on the show, brother. Thank you, thank you for the opportunity to be here, bro. This dude was meant for this show. We should, you might actually have to take over hosting uh, one day, but we're gonna start with the throwback. So this is 2014, probably, 15. That, that was representing Venezuela and Mexico. Wow. Yeah, that was a lot of players that play with me here that are in big leagues now too. And that, that was one of the best memories in my baseball career. Like a lot of professional players here. And I really had fun there. Oh, dude, I bet. Yeah. How old were you? I was like 14 years old. All yeah. right, 14 as Walter right there, baby. Yes, we know you're a great baseball player, <laughs> but dude. Ooh, you oh. see that, Bobby. That's a lot of swag on there. <laughs> that was so fun moments with my family, with my brother. And I just having fun, just being me. Were you always a good bowler? No, I mean, doing crazy things like that, yeah, I'm the best. But like playing, like real playing, I'm not. <laughs> Next one, another throwback, and here you are in a Yankees hat. My dad is a big fan of the Yankees, so we got a lot of bunch of things of Yankees when I was young. And they are my brothers, they are my life, they are part of my life. And when we are together, when we are all three on all four with my sister, we feel like we got everything. Something that we all love about you is, is your story, how you got to the big leagues. Yeah. So you think about that little kid in the back seat, yeah. and here you go. I can do all things, and yes you can, baby. Yeah. You're pulling up to Yankee Stadium. Dude, this is awesome, man. Dang. It's one thing that I got in my mind all the time. Like, I'm blessed to be playing for the best team in the world, you know? And I'm blessed to be healthy. And till I'm being healthy, I can do everything, you know? I can. It's, if I can't do it, I'm just gonna try, you know? So in my mind, it's like, I can't do that. I can't do that. I just go for it. So, good. Dude, I love that. We all know that you play with a lot of passion and you're a hungry dude. And I think that this picture with the wolf and that saying, that's you right there. This is my favorite for Absolutely, you have to be my favorite. It's like representing my, myself, you know? I'm always hungry, I'm always looking for good things. I'm always want to win the games, want to be better for myself and try to help the people around me. And that's me, just like a wolf, protecting my family, protecting my guys. And this was, dude, Ooh, what, what a special, special moment, moment, man. I can't imagine that. Like, I, I'm always dreaming about it. And when I did that, I was like, I hit a homer against the Red Sox, you know? It's more, it's more like a dream. Like, bam. Yeah. I feel so proud of myself about this. Yeah, and you got swag as a bowler <laughs> and as a baseball player. A lot of special moments for you on the baseball field so far here at Yankee Stadium. This was one of them, and you got to paint it. Two friends that I have here in New York, and this is a guy from Venezuela. One of the best painters that I ever seen in my life. And the guys from here, they contact him like, we need you make this paint for this guy. Like, he's a really good person. And the guy make this paint. This look real. This yeah. look like a picture. And that guy was pretty awesome, honestly. Yeah, he got the emotion down really yeah. well. And you got the, the flag, Venezuela oh. flag right here. Oh man, dude, all right, so we, we see your necklace right here. And also, anytime you put on something really cool jersey-wise, sunglasses, man, you got you got next level swag. This is it right here, man, in the mind. Man, I love this moment. This was in Charleston, 2018. And the guy who take pictures for us, Zach, he took a lot of cool pictures. And this picture was epic, bro. It's was so clean. Unique. Well, so pretty beautiful. If there's a picture of you to hang up or another painting, it's probably this it's one. It's probably this one. <laughs> hey, I'm going to think about it, yeah. <laughs> All right, here we go. You get a chance to meet a lot of cool people playing in baseball, sure. and this is one of them. Yeah, he's my favorite singer for sure. And I had the opportunity to meet with him in Tampa 2021. He's a humble guy. He's a really good person and my favorite for yeah, sure. Yeah, dude. It's awesome that you get a chance to do that. Yeah. And of course, you gotta hang out with the boys at the beach. Yeah. This is nice, man. This is a really nice. You know, we got a lot of good friendship here in baseball. You make a lot of connection with too many people. And these two guys are one of them, especially Oswald. We've been playing together for a couple of years. And I love being with my brothers being there and just having fun all the time. With the boys, baby. Yeah. 
you are a great son, <laughs> and I'm sure your mom loved these flowers when she got them. Yeah, she's the best mom in the world, in the world, you know. So she did everything for us, and I want to get that back for her. Like I want to be, do everything for my mom and my dad and my family because I feel like they give up everything that they can. So for my mom, this is just one little special thing that I have to get back for my mom in all my life. There she is. My beautiful mom. She is my entire life, honestly. I love it. <laughs> How proud is she that you're doing something that you love for your career? She is so proud of myself. She, uh, she is so proud of me because we was like a teammate when we was young, you know? We was like, my dad was the guy who was care, take care of the, of the family, about the money, about all these things. Well, inside of the house was my mom doing everything for us. The school, the like homeworks, like in the kitchen, in the home, everything. My mom was that, that, that type of woman, so I appreciate all those things. And she instilled a lot of hard work in you because yeah. this is what got you to the big leagues. A lot of hard work, a lot of hours in the gym. Yeah. When I'm in the gym, I use some there, I just forget everything. I'm with my personal trainer in, in, in Miami, it's Ivan, Ivan Flores. In Orlando last year, I've been with other guy, Vidal Morejon. And they know like when I'm there, I love to work because I, it's just something like I get off of all the work, get off all the noise and just focus on the work. So for anybody out there who isn't following you just yet, where should they go <laughs> and what should they expect from your social media posts? So my Instagram is ocabrera13. 13 was my best number, my favorite number when I was young. Now it's 95, for sure. <laughs> but I don't gonna change that in Instagram. It was my Instagram for a while. So, oh, camera 13, follow me there. I will love that. A lot of baseball photos, fun photos off the field coming your way. <laughs> yeah, for sure.